in this given circuit he is asking about he is asking us to find i1 and i2 in the given circuit so instead of circuit elements here in this circuit he gave us the parameters z parameters okay um here in this case our z12 and z21 they both of them they both of them are same so basically i can write a z equivalent network or t, t equivalent network sorry so this value is z11 minus z12 so this is z12 this is z22 minus z12 so i'll end up with 6 minus j4 minus j4 uh, 8 minus j4 so i can replace this block box with this okay um, that's one way to do it but i'm not going to do this here in this case i'm going to solve this by using the z parameters so here i know two equations one is um, v1 equal to z11 i1 plus z12 i2 and v2 equal to z21 i1 plus z22 i2 okay so do we know v1 we don't know v1 um, v1 is right here don't get confused with uh, the given source voltage v1 is voltage right before this box but this is the source voltage now there is a voltage drop across two ohms so you cannot use that now another important point your v2 is short circuited so what is the v2 value v2 must be zero because voltage across short circuit is zero so i'm going to use this v1 equal to z11 which is 6 i1 minus j4 i2 and v2 is 0 minus j4 i1 plus 8 i2 now here i have three unknowns in the given one is uh, v1 i don't know how much is that and i don't know i1 i don't know i2 so i need two more equations sorry one more equation because three unknowns i have two equations so i need one more equation that one more equation i'm going to use the kbl in loop one so loop one apply kbl apply kbl so if i apply kbl in loop one two at an angle of 30 equal to 2i1 plus v1 so I can say V1 equal to 2 at an angle of 30 minus 2I1. I'm going to take this as my third equation, first equation, second equation. Now to simplify this, substitute equation 3 in equation 1. If I substitute that in equation 1, equation 3, so 2 at an angle of 30 minus 2I1 equal to 6I1 minus j4 i2 so if i move the 2 i1 to the other side 2 at an angle of 30 equal to 8 i1 minus j4 i2 now i have the second equation so this is i'm going to label this as fourth equation my second equation i have um, minus j4 i1 plus 8 i2 equal to zero so this is the second equation right so what i'm going to do i'm going to multiply this with uh, j2 to to make i1 equal so that i can cancel out so i will end up with a zero minus j square 8 which is 8 i1 plus j 16 i2 so let me make this as 15 i mean fifth equation now my fourth equation i have 2 at an angle of 30 equal to 8 i1 minus j4 i2 now i'm going to subtract these two equations so plus it's going to be minus minus plus so minus 2 at an angle of 30 equal to these two cancel out i will end up with j20 i2 so my i2 equal to 
minus 2 at an angle of 30 divided by 20 at an angle of 90 so 2 over 20 which is 1 over 10 so minus 0.1 at an angle of minus 60 because 30 minus 90 it's going to be I mean if I put them together it's going to be let me do this so minus 2 over 20 at an angle of 30 minus 90 so it's going to be minus 0.1 at an angle of minus 60 degrees so I can take out this negative by adding 180 degrees so I can write this as 0.1 at an angle of minus 60 plus 180 so I removed this negative by adding it adding 180 degrees so it's going to be 0.1 at an angle of 120 this is my I2 now substitute I2 in any one of those equations so which equation I'm going to substitute um, let me use this 8 I1 plus J16 I2 equal to 0 so 8 I1 plus 16 times 9 16 at an angle of 90 so J16 I can write this as 0 plus J16 um, so when you convert that into polar format it is going to be 16 at an angle of 90 times I2 is I can use 0 0.1 at an angle of 120 equal to 0 so I will end up with 8 I1 or let me use the negative so since it has a lower magnitude so I'm going to use this as minus 0 0.1 at an angle of minus 60 so 8 I1 equal to uh, 1.6 so here I'll end up with the negative if I take it to the other side of equal it's going to be positive at an angle of 30 degrees so I1 equal to 1.6 over 8 at an angle of 30 so our I1 I1 equal to uh, 0.2 at an angle of 30 degrees and I2 equal to 0.1 at an angle of 120 degrees or you can say minus 0.1 at an angle of minus 60 degrees those are the I1 and I2. Thank you.